What's up guys, Zach Scott here playing Batman Arkham Origins and I do apologize for a relative, come on, let's go, what the heck? Sorry, I'm trying to, there we go. I apologize for a relative lack of videos lately. Um, I was on vacation, I went to Florida. I didn't make that completely clear in in all of my videos. Uh, so some people who may, like for example, only watch Batman Arkham Origins and not watch any, any of the other videos, maybe didn't realize that I went on vacation, so I apologize. Uh, for that, I recorded a lot of the previous Batman videos uh, in advance. Unfortunately, I wasn't able to record a ton of them, uh, so there was a f there were a few several days. I was on like an every other day schedule. I scheduled them in advance. I was on like an every other day schedule for a little while. I apologize. I'm back from vacation from Florida, back home. No more delays, hopefully. So let's uh, let's get the show on the road with Batman: Arkham Origins right now. Batman. The cops investigating this crime should have a relay station set up. It'll look like a mobile satellite dish, probably on a rooftop. So apparently penguins guys Is this you guys? Him. Am I supposed to fight you? Put him up. No guns, please. I don't like dealing with guns with you guys. It's always the nuts. Hey, I'm not nuts. There we go, a 15 hit combo. Taking out cops. <laughs> Am I supposed to be doing that? I can never tell. Let's uh, debug, decode, uh, decode this. There we go, not debug. Rubio, what's your 20? On the balcony for a smoke with a menace. Those men on the balcony, that could be my way in. All right, well let's, let's go get it. Right by the body. Yeah, whoa, 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 whoa. Hi. That was me. That's a crime. What's a crime? It's a crime being this sexy. Oh, what? I was trying to do my special takedown move. No slack. No slack for cops. Are these cops? I can't tell. What am I doing? Is this my way in now? Have we determined that this is a good way in? What's over here, though? Have we determined that this is a cool thing? What is this? Got an Enigma data pack. You know, I'm uh, I'm not the type of gamer. I mean, I don't know. If I weren't recording, I would probably track down all the Enigma gamer, not gamer packs, data packs. Uh, but since I'm recording a video trying to make it flow well, uh, I, I will not be getting all of the Enigma data packs unless I just happen to find them. I'm not going to go out of my way to look for them. Let's go in here and see what this building's all about. Lacey Towers. I like my girls when they wear things lacy. All of them. <laughs> um. Oh, fire extinguisher. <laughs> All right, let's just, uh, I don't know where we're going. Let's just go through this area like it's no big deal. I don't really know. Oh, here we go. I open this door. There we go. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Sionis is safe, safe house. What? There's a, there's a guy on the floor. Oh, dear. That's not what I want to be doing. Saw something over here though. Oh well, there's another data pack. There we go. Another one of ten found. Police line, do not cross. Okay, okay. So I guess, I guess Batman obeys the police only when there's yellow tape. I cannot cross. Are you kidding me? Oh no, he's like, oh no, yellow tape, my weakness. <laughs> oh, okay, what is going? Police go believe Penguin murdered Black Mask, but why would he send me here if he was the killer? It doesn't add up. All right, let's uh, scan for evidence. Oh, here we go. Is this is this black mask? What the heck? What's the button I need? Oh, there we go. Is this black mask? Where are this the police? This crime took place days ago. The fire and the exposure to the elements make identifying the victims difficult. The male victim is wearing a black mask, but I can't positively identify him as Roman Sionis without a DNA analysis. Something I can't do in the field. What, you can't do a DNA analysis in the field? Oh my god, what the heck is that? No! Oh, upskirt. Upskirt shot. Oh, nope, never mind. She's dead. That's kind of gross. So she's dead. 
<laughs> I can identify the female victim based on her All fingerprints. Right. Tiffany Ambrose, Roman Cyanus' girlfriend, or one of them at least. She was no angel, long list of priors, but nothing to indicate she was the target here. I like my girls when they wear things lacy. The fire spread as a result of a Molotov cocktail thrown into the room. Oh, here's a rewind. It may have been intended to destroy evidence. Is that Catwoman? Is that Catwoman? Who is that? No, is that Black Mask? Who is that? All right, we analyze that. This is an exciting analysis. Uh, the shallow trajectory of the bullet suggests the shooter could be someone of Penguin's height. But the grooves on the floor suggest that the victim was killed by someone leaning back in a chair. What? <laughs> Batman, you're too smart for me. I would have never figured this out without you. This bullet was fired from a revolver. Ballistics analysis indicates a low angle of trajectory. The shooter could have been someone of Penguin's height. But the pattern in the gunpowder residue suggests the bullet was actually fired by someone lying on the ground. The heck is this? This is spooky Batman mystery hour. This is creepy. These fingerprints are a match for the penguin, but they're on top of the soot from the fire. The cops were right. Penguin was in the room, but these prints prove he was here after the murders were committed. If he didn't kill Black Mask, who did? The I only don't... thing I know for certain is that Tiffany's shooter was lying on the floor. But why? This is just, just relaxing. These white streaks are shoe polish. Whoever shot Tiffany was being dragged along the floor. Besides the victims, there were two other people in the room. Tiffany's shooter and whoever was dragging the shooter. The location from which the male victim was shot may tell me more. Tell me more, tell me more, let's just go over here. The DNA here doesn't belong to either of the victims. Whose is it? I don't know. The fight broke out when someone startled the shooter. It's not clear who won the fight. It could have been either one of them. I should review the evidence to see if I can learn anything more about either the intruder or the shooter. All right, where's the next spot? Oh wait, okay, rewind or fast forward. Okay, yeah, he's beating him up. He broke a table, apparently. Oh, there's some evidence over here. This is like way more advanced than like, ah, uh, this is crazy. Okay, how do I, how do I review this? All right, come on. Fabric analysis indicates the intruder was wearing a white suit or sport jacket. This fabric swatch could help identify the intruder, but I still can't identify the male victim's shooter. There's one impact area I haven't checked for clues. Which is over here. Man, this is detailed. Oh, what? Whoa. This it's DNA a, it's is a good from girl. a female victim. The level of oxidation suggests it's been here for several days. Who would do that to a girl? If I review the evidence, I may be able to find out what she was doing when she was attacked. Sure, let me just walk over here. Rewind some stuff, I guess. Is this how this works? Oh, I, I know what she was doing. She was getting bent over. What? 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 Okay, never mind. Sorry. <laughs> Wait, where'd she go? God, this is so creepy. This is by far the creepiest Batman game I've played. What is this? What is this? She was sending text messages to Roman Sionis about someone named the Joker. Dun dun dun! The Joker. Someone killed Black Mask. But this crime took place several days ago. And I saw Black Mask earlier tonight. The only answers I have raise more questions. Who is the Joker? Was he the killer here? Or is he one of the assassins? I have a body, an unknown shooter, and an unknown assailant who attacked the shooter. I need to match the DNA samples against the records in the National Criminal Database to identify who was in the room. Okay. 
<laughs> Alfred, well, I need access to the National Criminal Database. Well, the only way to do that would be to infiltrate the Gotham City Police Department. Then that's where I'm going. Sir, you'd need to physically hack into their servers. If you insist on doing something that foolish, you'll need a powerful non-lethal weapon. I recommend coming back here to pick up your concussion detonator. Not a bad idea. No, to send the Batwing to give it to me like you did in the other games. Just give me the concussion detonator and send me it directly. Alright, I guess I'll go to the freaking Bat Cave to get this concussion detonator. This is spooky, being able to like rewind time and stuff and... Ugh. Seeing what people were doing in the past is some sort of weird... Spectrum analyzer thing with crazy amounts of digital signal processing built in. I like my girls when they wear things lacy. When they do, it just drives me crazy. Oh God! No more. Okay, here we go. We want uh what? Okay, I figured it out. Is he down? Now he's down. Is he down? Come on, get him. That was crazy. Level up time. Yeah. Let's look at my uh, close combat upgrades. I'm loving these. Uh, do I already have these? I think I do. Um, blade dodge takedown. That sounds cool. I'll, I'll get that, yes. Did I get it right? I get it right. I got it right. Who knows? Okay, anyway. Let's go. Legendary Vigilante. Where am I going? Back to the back cave. 8-2. Come in, 8-2. Dispatch, Delta 4-4. Four, four. Can you raise Delta 8-2? Alright, the, the bat wing is available for fast travel. How do I use it? <laughs> That's what I want to know. How do I actually use the freaking Batwing? Are there like sites around here where like they're just they're just there? Okay. Ooh, look at this. Oh, Enigma! I still got to complete some. I complete all of Anarchy stuff in like one video. That was awesome. Shadow Vigilante Gotham. What is this? How do I call in the um? You know. How do I call it in? Where's Five, my... four, four. Delta eight two. Delta eight two. Come in. Delta eight two. Come in. Delta eight two. Report. All right, shut up, Delta, Delta eight two. No response from eight two. Please proceed inside to confirm eight two status. Okay, but but for real, where do I get the freaking helicopter or not helicopter? The bat wing. Where is uh? Let's see. I don't even know. Where's my where's my marker? Like what are you? Oh, over here. This is the back cave. Sweet. Can I just click on this? And then do like hey, fast travel right here. Gosh. Back claw. You know what I need to I need to figure out how to call the bat wing. I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Apparently this should not be too hard. There's a comms tower here. I just gotta go to it. Set the waypoint right there. And then if I go there, I th I think this'll work. I'm not 100% sure, but I'm gonna try it out and see what I can what I can do. And I, I think maybe if I get there, there's a bat wing drop point or something. I don't know how it works, honestly. But I would love to know. I just gotta figure out where the freaking bat wing is from here. All right, but I made. Uh... All right, here I am. Now what do I do? Um, what are you doing back here, hmm? Taking a break from tearing up the city? Well, you're wasting your time. This tower's given up all its secrets. Um, at least the ones your limited cognitive capacity allows you to process. What? Is this a Riddler thing? Backclaw, do I use my backclaw on this? No, I don't even know how to open this up. Well, I I think there's a way for me to be at this comm tower and call the 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 bat wing for the for its drop point. I don't know 100% though how to do it. Um it seems like it would be relatively easy. 
Uh, not sure. I guess I will be right back. Okay, I'm an idiot. Here it is. The Batwing drop point. I just click on that. There we go. Sorry. I just didn't want to spend all my time researching and, I mean, not researching, but, you know, like, trying to figure it out by trial and error. Uh, what do I do now? What, what? I'm, hold on. Where is this Batwing? Where did I end up going? Did I go anywhere? I'm still here. What's, what's happening? Oh, I get it. I'm an idiot. Again. I click on this Batwing drop point. There we go. Okay, this is how you fast travel. Sorry, guys. I'm learning how to fast travel. This is exciting. I'm getting rid of all my fumes in the Batcave for Alfred to deal with. Here I am, Alfred. Breathe in my fumes. Welcome home, sir. Thank the you. The concussion detonator is on your workbench. Remember, if you use that instead of your fists, you'll do less lasting damage to those police officers and civil servants. Noted. Noted. Now I just gotta find my workbench. I would imagine it's over here somewhere. Batsuit chamber was an option. Where's my workbench? Where's my workbench? Where does Batman do his work? Maybe down here. Alfred, go find out where my workbench is. Uh, it seems like it could be over here. Um, there we go. Concussion detonators. Nice. Oh, yes. Okay. Got him. Put him in my pocket. And uh, that's that. I, now I got to go access the GCPD servers. Something I can do later. Guys, thanks so much for watching. Uh, I'm going to do some training missions in between now and uh, the next video. Hopefully I'll get a little bit better at combat. I think I'm decent, but I can always be better. Thanks so much for watching. Thanks for all of your support. Sorry for going on vacation. I loved it, but I know you guys were missing some of the videos. But I'm back again. Goodbye. I'm Zach Scott. Subscribe if you have not. If you like this video and want to help this channel grow, all you got to do is click the like button below. Thanks so much for watching and check out these other awesome videos. See you next time.